I use the City of Sydney cycling map and the Randwick City Council bike route network to plan my route. It's about 30 minutes to ride the whole way. From Belmore Road, I ride down Arthur Street, across Botany Street, right into Wansey Road and onto the shared path. Always keep some distance between you and parked cars so drivers can see you on the road. Feel free to walk your bike between the cars and onto the shared path. Once on the shared path, I take it all the way to the lights at Randwick Racecourse. On shared paths, slow down and ring your bell when you see a pedestrian. The Sydney Cycling Guide and Map has all the do's and don'ts for you if you're new to cycling. At the lights, dismount and cross onto Darley Street and into the park. Keep to the left unless you're overtaking another cyclist. Take the Federation Way exit out of Centennial Park, across the cobblestones and along Federation Way onto the Cleveland Street Cycleway. The Anzac Parade intersection is large, so it has a bike light to ride across the first section. Back on the shared path, I ride around beside South Dowling and cross South Dowling at Charles Street. I head straight and get onto the Burke Street Cycleway through the back streets. Burke Street Cycleway has bike crossings and a separated bike path just for bikes. Watch out when crossing Devonshire Street. Even though cyclists have right of way, some drivers are still getting used to the cycle way. At Taylor Square, I ride through the shared space and onto Oxford Street. Wait for the traffic lights to turn red and hold oncoming traffic so you can join the bus lane. Stay in the bus lane all the way down to College Street. It's busy, but it's only a short stretch and it's downhill. When you arrive at the College Street intersection, Signal to traffic you are going to turn left and pull off to the left of the lights. Follow the lights onto the College Street bike path. The bike path stops at Macquarie Street. Cross here and into another shared zone. Here I get off my bike and walk through Queen Square and onto the pedestrian crossing at Phillips Street. Back on Phillips Street, I get onto my bike again and ride through to Martin Place. Riding is a great way to get to and from the city. For your local bike route, check online at Sydney Cycleways forward slash get riding.